If you're offering people nothing other than competence, you have to be very fucking competent. It's not Sunak, but Keir Starmer, who's been feeling the heat so far this week, having to suspend two parliamentary candidates for comments they've made about Israel. Jewish Labour movement say it's not been Labour's finest hour. In what should have been a bad week for the Tories, Labour have somehow managed to steal defeat from the jaws of victory. Oh, I know. I wouldn't be surprised if the Tories call an election now. This is like as good as it's going to get for them. Do you know what I mean? Like yeah, it's been it a disaster. Feel like that for Labour. I also think the other serious issue here is Keir Starmer is kind of staking his claim purely on competence. You know, we've seen rowing back on all sorts of pledges, green investment, the £28 billion figure, that's been essentially withdrawn by the party. And when all you're offering is competence, you cannot afford slip-ups like this. Starmer's working on a bomb-proof manifesto. There is a sense that he is playing it safe politically and he is following the idea that you never interrupt your enemy while they're in the process of making a mistake. But 